on, guys? Ryan here at Tech Source. I'm in our Georgia location. Um, has some requests on shooting some videos with printing on brown bags and bags in general. But uh, so we, we got us some brown bags for Uline. They're very cheap. Um, so this is a great thing to have any in any shop that does a lot of fashion designing or just wants to add an extra spin to their customers when they're presenting shirts to them. So air dry inks are also an option to print on this, but we are printing today our Alpha Series ink from Matt Sui. Um, if you look at some of our previous videos we've done, uh, we did a video on the whole Alpha Series kit and I pulled the direct print black, which is this, from that kit. So not only is the Alpha Series kit great for garments, but it's also great, great for air dry inks and great for printing on brown bags and yard signs, that sort of thing. This uh, brown bag is going to kind of absorb the ink so you don't have to hit it too hard. It's going to dry pretty quick as well. So today I'm going to print on this brown bag using a simple one-color design text source logo on our Genesis press. It's a four-color two-station, just a simple entry-level entry level press, uh, no micros, nothing of that nature. But again, Alpha Series kit, this is direct print black, pretty simple and easy to use. Poured it straight out of the bucket into the screen. So we'll go and get started. Again, this is a great thing to have in a lot of shops. The bags, you can get a ton of bags very cheap and it is extremely easy to print on very quick. So just open your bag, make sure your palette's a little bit tacky. You don't want to be over tacky because if you do when you're pulling this off it's going to be hard to peel the bags off so i'm going to just add a little mist not much so we'll put the brown bag on nice and flat my logo is going to be right in the middle when you're setting up your artwork and you're burning your screens you always want to make sure you have the artwork oriented the correct way because typically when you're pre screen printing, you have the, the image facing this way because that's the way you put the shirts on. Well, with this bag, you gotta make sure the artwork is turned the correct way. So make sure that you get that step correct. Um, so we got the bag on. Again, this is the Matsui Alpha Series Direct Print Black. Do one pass, make sure you always flood your screen, one printing water-based ink. Pull that up. We'll pull the bag off. Might have been a little bit too much spray, but and there's your brown bag. Very, very simple to do. And you can kind of tell it's already starting to dry on the bag a little bit. So you can set this bag off to the side on the floor, it'll dry. If you have a dryer, you can shoot it through the dryer at a high temp speed because this can possibly burn don't need to over cure it because this bag is not made to get wet. If it does get wet, it's a brown bag, it's going to fall apart anyways. So you don't have to over cure this. Don't worry about washing out. So yeah, there's a brown bag. And I really like these bags because they kind of stand up on their own. So if you want to print on both sides, it's great. Some of the other bags that you use fall down. They don't really lay flat. Slide your bag on. One good pass through. Make sure it stays, your water base stays flood. That. So you got a printed bag. So again, this was at the Alpha Series kit. Um, you can mix these colors within each other to make other, other colors. It's, it's a very simple, very, it's a great kit to have in every shop because um, water base is, it's, it's, it's a large, large popular item to have nowadays. So um, print on substrates, print on paper bags. Yeah, so subscribe to our YouTube channel. Check us out online at screenprintingsupply.com.